What's up gamers, Jem here and welcome to the first look for Phoenix Point Year 1 Edition and let's begin. Now, uh, th this isn't type of um, a game that I would normally play, it's not my type of genre, so just keep that in mind. Maybe I should go easy, but you know what, I'm up for a challenge, let's do veteran. Uh, play prologue and tutorial, yeah let's do that. So I do apologize in advance if I'm playing really badly because this isn't really my type of game that I would play. You know, uh, turn-based or strategy games, stuff like that. It's just not my cup of tea. But you know what? The the trailer looked okay. The the graphics and the environment and stuff looked really cool. Uh, and I thought, might as well try a first look and see how we do. And who knows, maybe I'll end up liking this game. <laughs> um, but without uh, a moment of due, I hope you do enjoy this first look as we're waiting for the game to load on normal difficulty. I am going to be trying to play this with mouse and keyboard because I believe Where mouse and keyboard... Alert. Other refugees are coming from the coast. 400 yesterday. The mist is coming fast. We need weapons, vehicles and food. If there's anyone that can respond. Eight, three, seven, we two, listened to nine, the number stations five, every day. Yeah. I took turns with Jacob, waiting for our signal. And finally, it came. A scarab got it too. It's AI directing it to our rendezvous point. We had no news from Symes for many months. Did he send the activation codes? I was desperate to know what happened to him. The mutants were on the march again. Something was happening. If the mist was back, then it meant that the Pandora virus was mutating again, twisting the human form into new horrors. We needed to regroup, rebuild. But first, we had to get to that scarab. So yeah, as I was saying, mouse and keyboard seems like the best way to play these type of games, so we'll try with mouse and keyboard. Um, camera movement, hold left click. Yeah, left click to drag or WSD. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna <coughs> I'm gonna prefer to do WSD for this. Um, camera rotation, Q and E, and T and G to zoom. Oh, okay. So if I do T and G, it zooms out and zooms in, right? But if I use my mouse wheel, it makes me go up and down. So I think that's good to know as well. Um, let's press OK. This is the rendezvous point. The scarab is waiting for us right over there. If you're a soldier, let's move. Can we move there? Okay. Cool, we're moving there. Reporting enemy contact. I see an enemy there. Enemy icons, show enemy, blah, blah, blah. Tap on the soldier or press tab. Uh, tiles inside a blue area allow soldiers to move and shoot in the same turn. Okay, that, I can I can deal with Rolling that. <laughs> your movement is interrupted if you spot an enemy. This doesn't end your turn. Okay, that's good to know. F to shoot. Okay, uh, the health bar displays your current hit points. So I guess this is mine. Yeah, this is it says your current hit pot uh, hit points. Okay, let's just hit shoot then. Tap the fire button. So I do have to hit shoot. Okay. Oh, that's cool. That is really cool. I like, I like how the camera just zooms into the world like that. That's really cool. I thought it would just be like, like everything, like the whole camera would be what I'm looking at right now. But I do like that it it zooms in and it has like that tactical, awesome cutscene thing playing. Um, and turn. So it's their turn to play. Okay, and then they try to run away after attacking me. So I'm playing as playing as that person. F to attack. When shooting, you can enter free aim mode for precise targeting. Oh. Okay, I, when it said free aim mode, I thought it actually meant it would go like first person shooter where I'm just shooting as I aim, but no, this is more like uh, Fallout where you're just picking what body part you want. Is there like a chance system? Is this how it works? How does this work? Let me read. 
Shooting at different body parts can disable them, denying the enemy some abilities. The outer blue circle shows you where the shots will land. The more accurate the weapon, the smaller the circle. Okay. So if I if I shoot like here, would that mean it's shooting the other leg as well? Because it's still part of the blue area. So I'm shooting both legs. Is I hope that's what it means. I'm gonna go to the leg. Oh, just took it out. Now that you know the basics of movement shooting, it's time to finish the mission. This must be the scarab. It's seen better days, but vehicles are a special type of Jump unit inside. like transport, enter vehicle, move assault. Okay. You know what? I already forgot what the move button was. <laughs> was it right click or left? Okay, it's left. Let's do this. Oh, or right. You can do right as well. Okay, I'm gonna use right click because it doesn't give me an option. Rolling out. Your active soldiers are out of ox. Do you want to end your turn? Yeah, sure. Uh oh. Should have taken cover. <laughs> oh, you're just gonna stand right next to me? Oh, there's another person there. Oh, are they gonna attack the car? No. Actually, is there even a point to taking cover? Because they're all melee. No one, no one's hitting me with range. All allies and spotted enemies will appear as icon. You can hover or click those icons. Um, I don't think I can hit them from there. I'm just going to go here. And then I'm going to use F for that person. So... I don't, I, here's the thing I don't get about free aim and shoot. With free aim, I get to have control on where to shoot, right? But shouldn't shoot automatically pick whatever's best? Like, doesn't the game know what the best place to shoot is? I'm just gonna hit shoot. Evacuate. Okay, let's just go here. Okay, I'm just gonna sh kill this dude. And then, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go here. Stay a little bit back. I'll try to get there in one piece. Yeah. So that way, this person will get the hit because they have more health. Okay. And say hello to you. Like right next to them, <laughs> right next to them, headshot. Enter vehicle, yeah, sure. Yeah, and just press right click there. Yep, enter vehicle. I guess it's over, or. Or do I get to drive the vehicle? No, that's it. Okay, that was the mission. So, yeah, we just did the, tu the tutorial. Um, let's play level one. <laughs> And yeah, I am playing in normal mode, so let's see what the real game is like at level 1, or the first mission. And for the people who like this type of game, like this genre, like XCOM style, I hope you enjoy this video as well, and I hope, uh, you know, you're satisfied with After the amount of hours gameplay I'm showing. The howling noises stopped, and then so did the scare up. I did a quick survey around our position while Jacob talked to the AI. There was an abandoned government reclamation station nearby. These places are usually good for scavenging supplies and equipment, but they often attracted desperate gangs. The AI gave us the reason for our stop, an emergency rescue signal from another Phoenix operative. We had a location too, right in the middle of that station. The Scarab made it clear that we should attempt a rescue before continuing with our journey. Despite no sign of the mutants, our comrade was clearly under threat. The Scarab's missile launcher would prove very useful. We've got visual on the building. The Phoenix operatives should be close by. There are hostiles up ahead, so stay vigilant. Soldiers have four action points to use for movement shooting and other actions each turn. These actions could be performed in any order. 
Okay, I can see it. It's on the bottom. Oh, wait, I can control the vehicle? Whoops. Medkits are powerful. Oh, I pressed the... Okay, I, pre I pressed the number. Oh, okay, tab is to switch characters. I was pressing 1, 2, 3 to just switch these two. But yeah, it does actually say tab there as well. Uh, I got two. What's, what does three do? X. Oh, X is to switch. One, two, three is for like uh, the specific weapon, and an I for what bags? Cool. There's a bag system where you could trade. That's interesting. I wonder if this game has online as well. Um, so I can actually move this car. Oh, I thought I was gonna run over, run over my steam. A uh, soldier can spend. Uh. Okay, this is really interesting. Can I shoot? Can't shoot yet. Okay, let's just let's go here. The operators, your operators will always kneel next to low terrain for cover. Okay, I'm just gonna move that right there. there. Um, I'm gonna put it. Up. I'm putting it under cover next to the fence. <laughs> I put it under the fence to take some cover, but I don't think that's gonna do anything. <laughs> okay, let's just shoot this guy. What does Y do? Select the target position direct Overwatch attack against enemies that enter the trigger cone during the enemy turn. Oh, there's also action point cost. I see. Anyways, let's kill this good dude. Okay. Didn't actually kill them, but... Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to... Yeah, I, I wasted... Uh... Whoops. Yeah, I wasted uh, my action point on that movement. Can I attack them? Can't even see them. No, I can't attack them. Although... Oh, no way! Oh, that is so cool! If you look at the mouse right, if I, if I put my mouse here, for example, you will see a line of sight going up and down towards the enemy to indicate that, yes, if you do move here, this is your line of sight. But if I go here, it won't show me any enemies line of sight because of this big rock. That is really cool because I was literally just wondering if I would have line of sight if I was to stand here. I'm on the move. Which, according to the game, I do. Oh. I guess I could just do that and then go back. Okay, that's everything done with that. I'm going to move this person here. Oh, use med kit. No, no. <laughs> Come get some. Shoot. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'll be right there. Go hide here. And turn. Okay. So it's my turn again because there's no enemies. At least no enemies discovered. Reload. Reload a weapon. Current weapon ammunition will be lost. Okay, so we don't even have unlimited ammo. Okay, I'm just high cover, soldiers will stand me line. Okay. I'm just gonna go there. These hostiles are carrying firearms, so don't leave your soldiers in the open. Oh, so the the different colours have different meanings to the line of sight, I see. So blue means you can move and shoot, you have enough points to do that, or yellow means... Uh, uh, yellow line means it has line of sight, but you don't have enough points to attack if you do use your move. Um, let's go here. 
ally located. You found an operator who sent the distress call. Friendly characters are marked with a white circle. Move a soldier inside to recruit. Cool. Why are you telling me this now when I'm moving here? <gasps> no, I meant to move right there. Ah, oh, what a waste. What a waste. Uh, still not sure what I'm supposed to be using this vehicle for. Let's just keep going. Oh, he actually destroyed the pathways. Cool. Oh, can I destroy this? Or the object? No? No. Um, okay, I'm just going to enter. Oh, that... That person's moving around. It's like a... It, basically a bot is controlling that one until I recruit it. How do I even get there? Okay. Just go right there. There we go. <laughs> That's like free moves or something. The squad has a new member. Omar is a heavy class soldier in heavy weapons. He can deal massive damage from short ranges. Okay. Just gonna go here. You know what? I'm moving this to around here. Just destroy all that cover. <laughs> oh my god. So we got these enemies there. Still not sure what you can... Action points free. Okay. Uh, Omar has heavy weapon... Heavy armor but no weapon. The crate on top of the nearby turn might contain useful items. Move out the building and use the jet jump ability. What tower? Uh, I have no idea what tower it's talking about. What, this? This... Oh, it is talking about that. I have to go there. I could only, like, reach... Let's, do, let's go there. Is that all? Yeah, that's all the points. I still have enough points for this person, but... Yeah, let me put it behind the full uh, armored wall. <laughs> I just realized how invested I am in this game. It already, it already has my attention. I know what's going on. I know how to play this game. <laughs> I didn't think it would happen because it's not my type of game, but I'm so invested into it already. I'm already like thinking about strategies and stuff. Okay, number four. Um, jump. Whoops. Okay. And... Let's go! Jump pack! Ooh, This reminds me of Worms. <laughs> like a 3D version of Worms right now with that jetpack. I don't know if you guys played this actually. Now that I remember it, I remember on PS2 there was a game called Worms 3D. I used to play that a lot. Crates usually contain useful items, okay. Can't I just right click? I don't know what I just did there. <laughs> uh, is this. That's a med kit. It's a cannon, I want that. Is this ammunition? This is ammunition. What happens if I put it in ready then? Okay. I'm ready out of uh, energy for that one. Let's go. <gasps> oh no, someone's got line of sight there. I just saw it before I just clicked it. Okay. If I go here, I'll have line of sight. Okay, let's do free aim for this one. We got head. Leg. Leg does 80. I still don't know what that means. Does that mean 80% chance? If I shoot the weapon, it's a hundred. I'm gonna shoot the leg. Yeah, I, I still don't know what those numbers mean. <laughs> um, I guess I could just go back here, just to hide. And then let's get this. Oh, I can use I can use the missile, but I only have like three shots, right? Or is it unlimited? No, I. It, okay. Um, 
me go back. Yeah, how do I go back? I'm trying to figure out. Oh, I have eight ammunition. Okay. I think this is an overkill, but let's see what happens. Well, awesome. Awesome. <laughs> this is my main. The, the, the tank is my main. <laughs> Uh, I'll be right there. Here. Yeah, let's uh, just end turn. Some ba some battlefields feature reinforcement points. And enemies will be arriving from them, so don't leave your soldiers exposed. Turn ended. This bandit has set Overwatch. He will shoot at anything soldier who enters his Overwatch cone. Do I at least get to see what the cone is? What what what's the cone? I don't... Okay, I don't get to see it. And I think... I know that it's an Overwatch coin because of that icon there with the eye. Or is it because it's red? Maybe it's both. Oh no, it's the icon. I can see it when I hover it, yeah. I see. Kill all enemy. Oh, okay, all operators must survive. Kill all enemy. That's my objective. I mean, I might as well just go with the tank. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> can I break down walls? Um, just gonna go here. I'm just breaking down stuff. Your weapon's out of ammo. Okay. Fire weapon. I do love this first person mode. It's not what I need though. I don't feel like yeah, I don't feel like I get then. Um what if I just move I'm right there? In. And then do it. No, I can't. I guess like all I can do is really just stay here. And then let me get let me get so Sophia. When when did she get healed? Didn't I get hit? Is there health regen in this game? Um just gonna go here. Oh, I just noticed when you hover over the moving area, it shows you what uh, stamina you're gonna have left. Um, now they did say that if this person is in my line of sight, I will get shot. But I don't know if this will be line of sight here. Okay, it will be. I see. Okay, that's not bad. And that's good to know. Your soldier's wearing armor which reduces damage according to the armor value. Different body parts may have different armor. Okay, I'm just going to end turn. Let's see what they do. Maybe I should put the vehicle in front. Oh, no. Okay. That's what you're going to do. Okay, it's another bandit coming out. I wonder if I could kill this person with my car. Let's see. F. Wait, if I just hit there. Oh, I destroyed the war! There's destruction here in this game. Okay, interesting. Now this can I can I kill Oh my god no I can't. <laughs> can't even see them. Maybe if I do this, yeah. Okay, let's shoot. I shot the wall more than that. Um, there's line of sight here. Target located. Oh, whoops, my bad. I forgot. Uh, I I plugged in my controller just in case if mouse if this game wasn't a mouse of mouse and keyboard type of game, but it is. Um, I wanted to move here. Finger on the trigger. Okay, I'm just gonna. Oh, what's it seeing here? Oh, it c you can see that enemy from here. Uh, that is very long range, so I'm gonna stay here. Uh, and then we have this person. Just gonna go here. 
Can I go upstairs? <gasps> there is an upstairs. Oh, that's what the scroll wheel is for. It's to show different levels. It's not. It's not about making your camera go up and down. It's literally to display different levels of floor. Okay. Where else can I go then? That's interesting. Oh, I could climb the wall, climb a ladder. Okay, let's do that. Let's climb up here. Okay, I'm 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 happy I'm happy with this. I don't think the bandits are actually going to leave. Well, the, these... These, uh... Bots are really playing campy-like. Um... Just going to put this here. There's no line of sight. You know what? It's time to get out of there. Wow, I can I can fly all the way here. Hmm. Using. That is such a really cool ability. You, you like I could go so far with that. The thing is, I don't want to go in here and just start shooting. I'm going to get killed. But I don't know. I don't think I have a choice. I'm going to go back down. I'm going to kill this person here. Yeah, let's go here. No. Oh! Okay, yeah, you can actually see this person. Okay. Um, F. That's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. No, it's not gonna work at all. Um. Get, get the girl. It's not even undercover, that's the problem. Okay, with this one, I'm just gonna shoot straight ahead. But with this one, maybe Make I'll move haste. there. Whoops, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, that's it. I'm putting the vehicle here so my guy doesn't die and the vehicle will be in the way. <laughs> End turn. Uh oh, now they come. Oh my god, so close! No, my my car, my main, <laughs> my tank. <laughs> can I actually? Whoops, no. Uh, where's the car? What can I kill? I could kill them, but it will also take. Yeah, okay, it will also kill my characters. I see. So there is like friendly fire involved. Let me go here. Oh. You know, see if reposition. I think this is the dumbest thing I'm gonna do in the game. Oh no, they're like one hit. This character's days they will only have one action point and 50% accuracy for one turn. Okay, I'm saved. They're not gonna be able to kill me. I could just stand there. All they have is the ability to just move a little bit. Let's move this here. Okay, and then move Let's back. <laughs> uh, Targeting. Oh, bleeding. I can shoot them again. Awesome, I got like what? One person left? 
Yeah, <laughs> as, as the entire turn just moving closer to me. Okay, it's my turn. Let's just finish off. Mm. Yeah, let's just finish off this dude. Okay, and then... How far can I move? I can only move up there. Um, am I going to get this person? Can I'm just going to... I can't hide anywhere. Hold on. Yeah, I could hide there for the next turn. Can't kill them, right? Oh, I can. Could do it again. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Well, this doesn't use any points. Free aim. Let's do free aim. Head. I feel like this is a chance thing. This. Yeah, I think I think the number on the left is just your chance. Ah! Yeah, there we go. Ah! Omar, is it? Glad you found some gear, cause you're gonna need it. Now you're part of my squad. Well, I guess that's level one. Um, <laughs> like, like I said in the beginning, this isn't my type of game, uh, and I I would have been surprised if I would even be into this game. But I am into this game. I you saw me. I was so into this game. I was already my mind was still in the, like went into like focus strategy mode. Like I want to win this. Um, it's really easy to get into, and that's saying something from my perspective because um, again, this isn't my type of game. I would play. Um, I think that went really well, and the fact that I managed to beat level 1 in tutorial in normal difficulty I think it's safe to say After the battle, this is an easy to get into a game struggling through the rough uh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna exit that ahead. let's get rid of them and clean up this let mess. me just save game and then let me go to the menu <laughs> um, exit to main menu so yeah, this I think it's safe to say that this is an easy to get into game considering that, you know, I got into it uh and I didn't really have that much trouble at all. Uh everything was the tutorial was great. Everything was uh pretty much straightforward. Do this, do that, go there. Um the keyboard the bindings and stuff, they were all on the screen even if I forgot the game interface reminded me what the keys were and I'm sure the controller would be simple as well. Um but Obviously, I played with mouse and keyboard here, but I think the controller will be simple to play with as well. Um, quality looks great. Uh, the gameplay is surprisingly fun. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. <laughs> Thank you for watching my video. This is Jam, and I'll see you on the next one.